Hey guys, here we are at the Sydney International Cup 2024. We've got teams from all over Australia and New Zealand. Let's go check out some of the action. Hey, tell me a little bit about your team. Who are you guys? Uh, we are the Girls of Goals. We have, we made it in 2023 when we got together some girls with a, all played with boys and we just really strong team. We're an amazing team that we've been around for about two or three years now and most of our players actually play in this boys space within, within SAP and so we'd love to get them the opportunity um, to, at these tournaments to actually um, play as a team to actually show actually how good these girls actually are. And I'm coaching the under eight Brazilian soccer schools and the under 10s BSS Central Coast team. Oh, awesome. Is, it, is this them playing now? This is the under 10s Brazilian soccer schools Northern Beaches team. Ah, okay. So we've actually got two teams in the same competition. Yeah, great. Is this the first time you've been to SIG Cup? Um, yes, first time as a coach. I actually played in the International Cup as a player when I was around about these boys' age as well. So what do you think, um, what do you like about SIG Cup overall? Yeah, it's good. You've got a lot of quality players here and you get to see where our academy stands against the rest of Australian football, which is a really good uh, levelling sort of platform. Can you tell me about um, your team and how your SIG Cup's going so far? Yeah, well it's our first game so we're really excited to be here. Uh, it's Canberra Croatia, um, first tournament and first time here for a lot of the players and myself as a coach, so we're really excited to see what the whole tournament has to bring today. Uh, the club's a uh, really famous club with uh, a real rich history uh, across Canberra always does really well from the junior base up to senior football. Um, obviously Croatian heritage as well, um, but real proud history. I like how like the field's not too big and we can put in a bit more effort towards our gameplay. And it's less people on the field, so it should be a bit easier than normal outdoor soccer. We're from Perth and some people say we're the best club in Perth and we've travelled the furthest just to be in here so we'll hope we um, end up having a good tournament. Um, I hope we win because we came all the way from WA just to come here to play some matches so I hope we play as well as we can. I really like uh, the pitches, they're really high quality and also the whole quality of the tournament is really high, there's some really good teams here so I'm happy I get to push myself against some of the best in a in the world, really. Isn't girls, uh, tell me a little bit about your club. Uh, we're Southern District Raiders, all girls program, staff. It's just like, it's. I like how it's four days, you get to come down, keep resting, it's a lot of fun. You get to have a lot of time of soccer, more football, more better. I like how it, it gives girls who play with boys a chance to play with girls. And um, yeah, and we get to be competitive against each other. Yeah, great. As GSAP programs are only versing SAP, so we get to interact with academies. Southern District, who we are. Southern District, who we are. How's your SIG Cup going so far? Oh, I'm very impressed with it. It's, uh, there's some very, very good talent. It's good to see these little kids. Um, you can see the kids even at a very young age. They've just got the, the body movement, the finesse. Uh, <clears throat> some of them will play for Australia. I mean, they'll play top level. So, uh, yeah, I've been very impressed. 